Today was the deadline for 81 Trump-related people and entities to turn over all relevant documents to the House Judiciary Committee as part of its escalating investigation into Donald Trump's crimes and scandals. Last week the committee publicly stated that several unnamed people were already cooperating. Now the committee is revealing a huge name and it gives something away about the Robert Mueller probe. House Judiciary Committee Chairman Jerry Nadler appeared briefly on The Rachel Maddow Show tonight and revealed that Steve Bannon, of all people, has turned over several thousand documents to the committee. This on its own is a big deal. Bannon was in charge of the Donald Trump campaign at one point and he also played a key role in the Donald Trump White House. He's in position to know about crimes ranging from Trump-Russia election rigging to obstruction of justice. But here's the thing. The committee has made clear that this initial round of requests was solely for documents that have already been requested by other investigators. So if Steve Bannon responded to this request by turning over thousands of documents, it means Robert Mueller already asked Bannon for thousands of documents and Bannon already turned them over. It's long been reported that Steve Bannon spent 20 or more hours testifying to Robert Mueller, which was a strong indicator that Bannon sold out Donald Trump and everyone else involved. If Bannon had been uncooperative, the interview wouldn't have lasted that long. But now we know for sure that Bannon has indeed sold everyone out to Mueller, and now he's sold them out again to the Democratic House.